What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Happy Friday the 13th and Foodie Friday. Yeah, and it's snowing outside. Yeah. Very weird. Like a freak snowstorm in March. March. Par for the course, Friday the 13th. So, yeah. We're stuck indoors. Why not do a Foodie Friday video on Friday the 13th? Food. Yeah, yeah. So, today we've got a love with food box. This was number, uh, number. This number, the blah, 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 blah. this was another sample box that I, well, not sample, because I had to pay for shipping, so it wasn't technically free, but. So it's really small, really light, it's probably like what, less than a pound? So I don't know what's in there. Let's do it. Your snack adventure starts here. All right. You ready? Open that up. And... Ooh. Ooh. The blah, 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 blah. So, when you, when I think of love, I think of food. You filled in the blank with food? Oh, I thought that's what you were going to say. But that's what it says. <laughs> it's like a, like a postcard. Yeah, that's pretty cool. You can use that on your uh, little postcard exchange. Yeah. But, oh, cool. We got all kinds of goodies in here. And There's actually a lot of stuff yeah, for, for a, a sample. In a free little trial box. I'm you go first happy. this time. I went first last time. Okay, so we're going to put it over here. Okay. And, uh, I don't know. I'm going to go with this one. Ooh, cars. Cars, right? Roasted and salted peanuts. Roasted and salted peanuts. Hmm. That'd be good. <laughs> All right, put out your little paw. Take it, that's good. Oh, oh we can probably right. split some of those here. Don't worry, we washed our hands before we did this video. I didn't. Mm. Tastes like any other peanut that's roasted in. Yeah, they're not bad. They remind me of other various brand name roasted and salted yeah. peanuts, but. Detroit. Oh, so they're actually in, made in Detroit. The American Trail Mix, 1933. <laughs> I'll show you that again. That's they're cool. pretty good. But, so I don't know if this is all U.S. I don't know. food. We'll have I, I have no idea. But mm -hmm. maybe there'll be a little card or something. All right. Wow. Ooh, this what'd you is get? interesting. Did you get a beef stick? I did. Ooh. This is Morris's Kitchen Original Beef Stick. 100% grass-fed beef, gluten-free. Oh. Huh? Let's see, shall we? Gluten free, huh? You're up first. You you picked it. You want me to take the first bite? Yeah. Okay. Can I smell it? Oh. Oh, I like it. I like it too, actually. So, Larissa's Kitchen. That was really good, actually. I don't know where Larissa's Kitchen is, but... I don't either, but it it was... She can come to my kitchen anytime. Okay. Brunch. Um, Yeah, go with a little small little bar here. I don't know what this is. Tahini. Tahini Bar. Mighty Sesame Company. Pistachio. Ooh, it's a pistachio bar. Give this thing a gander. Ooh. Give it a little, oh, it breaks off pretty easy, so. Does it? Okay. No, you eat that one. These are super crumbly. Hmm. Pretty good. Tastes like onions to me. Mm. 
Not necessarily my jam, but I'm not really a tahini girl. I don't I don't know what tahini is. It's a sesame paste. Oh. Yeah, it's kind of gummy. Yeah. But it was good. I mean, you definitely taste like the pistachio and then mm. the seeds in there, so. <laughs> it's all right. All right. I'm a chip girl, so of course I chose this one. It is hers, hers, potato chips. Mmm. Gluten free. They're made in Pennsylvania. They look just like Ruffles. Where is this made in? Pennsylvania. Sorry, I was. I was... They're out of. Your I... finger covered it. They're out of Nottingham, Pennsylvania. Nottingham? Ooh. Do you think Robin Hood? Has anything to do with these chips? Robin Hood and Little John walking through the forest. He might. They're gluten free? Mm hmm. Tastes like a Lay's. Ruffles. Yeah, lay, Ruffle Lay's potato chips. Just your plain old. I wonder if they're like an off brand and less expensive or if they're a special brand and more expensive. Good. I mean, it's like a chip. They're good. All right. Okay. I'll go with mm. Welch's Fruit Snacks. Okay, so. Who doesn't love Welch's Fruit Snacks? Yeah. So we all know what Welch's, well, assuming we all know what Welch's Fruit Snacks is, but it's, I don't know how to explain it. It's Welch's Fruit Snacks. It's a gummy. Oh, yeah. I would try to give you one, but you don't take it. Coronavirus. That's right. What is this? They got little. They got little faces on. No, them. it's a it's a like a blueberry. So that's a blueberry. They have faces on them. Mine I'm doesn't. I'm gonna eat it. No, no, no. mine. That's a probably a raspberry or a strawberry. I love Welch's fruit snacks. They actually taste. Yep. Kind of like fruit. <laughs> They're not bad. Mm, these oh. are a super fruit mix too, so they've got like pomegranate and blueberry and star fruit, and mm, they're better than the normal ones. Those are good. I would like some of those. No, no, no. Oh, oh, you mean like mm -hmm. a bigger variety, our big bag of those? Mm -hmm. Well, because of the pandemic that's going on, we probably won't be able to find them. Well, that, and I don't want to go to the store because everybody's being a little ridiculous cuckoo for cocoa puffs right now so so next watch your hands don't look any doorknobs prevent high fives don't, don't, don't high fives elbow I, bump i implemented a no high five policy at work what do you do instead nothing if so we don't celebrate success oh right sounds like a good place to work <laughs> next on our list of food cookie thins thinsters chocolate chip real butter real sugar real good Deliciously crunchy. Really? Typically, I'm not a crunchy cookie kind of girl. So these are no artificial flavors or colors or preservatives. They're peanut-free, non-GMO, and real dark chocolate. And that's how we roll in Aventura, Florida. Oh, they're thin. Oh, look at that. Got a half moon. Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess that's not the lens. That's the lens. Skinny. Ooh. You ready? Cheers. Mm. I don't I don't dig them. I have to try another one just to see. I'm, I'm on the fence. They're too crunchy for me. I think chocolate chip cookies should be gooey. Oh, yeah. yeah. Last one. Last thing. What do we got? Another beef stick. Alright. You know it's a good box when you got two beef sticks. Yeah, you can't go wrong with beef sticks. So we got original beef mini stick. Chumps. Chumplings. Grass-fed and finished beef. U.S. E.D.? Used. Is it you? I hope it's not used. <laughs> zero sugar. Ooh, zero. Low calorie snack. Four grams of protein and 40 calories in this little stick. Now you can read. Oh, I'll show you that there. See it. I think it said whole. 
It's Whole30 approved, uh, certified gluten-free, non-GMO project. Nice. I know that that Whole30 is a pretty popular. Yeah, area. actually, I, I know a couple people that did it, and they, God, they dropped so much weight. But it's talk about it's a very restrictive. Yeah, I was gonna say talk about a lifestyle food change. That is a lifestyle. I mean, the crap yeah. that they said they could and can eat. Protein, that's, yeah, that's a good snack. Open it up and we'll try it. Okay. Well, I was trying to figure out where it was from. A cow. Made in the... Okay, in the USA, distributed by We Are The Champions, LLC, Florida. That's in Florida, too. Naples, Florida. Yeah. We Are The Champions, LLC. It's kind of a neat name. Mm-hmm. We'll see if they are the champions. We are the. You want to bite? Nope, you first. Oh, I always gotta go first. Because it's your snack. Because if it's not good, then you don't want to try it. Because I'm gonna trust your palate. Mm, not as good as the first beef stick, but for a healthy snack, it's peppery. Yeah. I like the other one better. Yeah. But for a healthy choice, I, I would eat it. Well, that was it for the food. Like I said, a small box. It was just a little trial to see if you like it. Um, companies love with food. And let's see. It was all, it was all USA food. Like yeah. You, yeah. You know what I'm saying. So we had Florida. Okay. We had another Florida. Welch's, New Jersey, Hers, Hers, Chips, good old PA, Pennsylvania. Well, apparently this one is a product of Israel, so they weren't all in the U.S. No. Unless it was like Israel. It was probably Maine. packaged in like New Jersey. Oh, I just made that up. Well. The best one. Larissa's, it doesn't say on the package, but I'll look it up before of the video and I'll see if I can find out where it was actually from and I'll put it up here somewhere. There, up here. Okay, right there. And the last one was Detroit. The Cars Peanuts. Technically the first one that we tried, but. Yes, yeah. pretty good. Yeah, actually it wasn't a bad bag or bad box. No, not for just paying shipping. Yeah, for I mean it's kind of cool to do the trials. Just go online, look free, uh, not free, but uh, trial yeah. um, food boxes. So it's always know. fun to try new things. Yeah, you guys stay safe out there. Wash your hands. Twenty seconds. ABCs twice. ABCs twice. Don't what panic you, by. What if you count your ABCs really fast? Then do it three times. Oh, okay. Okay. Don't, like I said, no high fives. So, air high fives. We're going to do demolition man stuff. We're, no touching. And it's okay. All right. Well, if you like this and you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell notification. Let you know anytime we upload a video. And uh, I'd appreciate it if you gave us a thumbs up. You know, let us know what you think. And uh, we'll catch you later. Bye, guys.